Hey everyone. So in an earlier video, uh, I think it was my last video, uh, I was saying that we, or I made a purchase, and I did. And there's our TR-96, and there's another one. Yeah, I found this one on Kijiji, and it actually ended up being only a half hour away from us. Hour, 40 minutes. And yeah, it's another, it's an identical TR-96 to this one, uh, same year and everything. Uh, has a lot of upgrades to it. Uh, the guy put uh, new pickup belts, new pickup teeth. Uh, those belts are made of actually crusher, gravel crushing conveyor belts. Used ones, but he made them up and uh, I think they'll work pretty well. They're pretty heavy. Uh, it has a new feeder chain. It has the, pla uh, the fiberglass, pl heavy plastic uh, feeder chain. So it's quiet. The paint is kind of shitty on it, but, you know, it is what it is. It's a 1987, so. Uh, why I decided to get another one? Well, this one here broke down. Uh, it's just a clutch burnt out. I got it off yesterday. As you can see, there's some heat to it. Uh, it's not grooved or nothing. It'll still, it's it'll work fine. I've got the new plate. New clutch discs coming. Here's the old one that I took off. And you can tell that they're wore out pretty good. Come on, focus. Yeah, so there's nothing much left of these ones. So I got two brand new ones. The middle plate is good. It didn't crack. Usually they crack. So it's, I shouldn't have had it in the rain here. It's kind of rained here. I should... Can at least have it underneath. There's the other two plates there. So you got your two fibers and one steel. And there's a, there's the pressure plate. So yeah, I got it all apart. And I'm just waiting for parts to come in tomorrow, and I'll slap her back together. So yeah, this one was down for a while. Uh, that's why I decided to uh, get this one. The money wasn't too bad. It's in pretty good shape. The only thing I don't like is it has... Uh, it also has four-wheel drive. So, that's... I don't really want to use four-wheel drive, but sometimes you might have to. Uh, you just, uh, to power these, it's a power wheel assist. To, uh engage the hubs you push these two buttons in and to disengage you push the middle one back in it's kind of like turning your hubs on a truck so it the one thing i didn't like on these both of these combines are this here caterpillar this is a 3208 turbo i'm not really that fond of uh the 3208 engine it's okay but the Ford is better. Uh, this one sounds a little different though. It's got a little, it still has a straight pipe. But it, it uh, it's, it's a little bit quieter. This uh, machine wasn't shedded, so that's why it looks a little rough. But yeah. Uh, had a chaff spreader, but took it off because it doesn't work that well with it. It needs its own hydraulic pump. Uh, what else? That's basically it. Nothing really too fancy for an older machine. Uh, just gonna rinse it off. It got muddy from the drive home. But yeah, so now we have three. Two TRs and one John Deere 9600. Uh, so hopefully it'll work good and we can get uh, the crop off quickly because of this bad weather that you can see. It rained about a half inch today. So that's a half inch more than what we needed. But I'll show you the rest of the other goodies that we got.
uh, I got, uh, he gave me a bunch of free parts, so, we'll see, uh, two almost new tires, uh, the chaff spreader, here they are on the trailer. Not bad rubber. A lot better than what's on there right now. So and they're mounted with rims. So yeah, I got a good deal on that. Uh, as you can see, the chest spreader. What else did I get here? Uh, he actually had one clutch disc. I used one. It's not bad. It's usable. Uh, middle plate, which is not bad. Some new belts. This baby here is the big one. This is your main drive belt. This belt right here is 700 bucks. So yeah, this thing's brand new. And I also got a new feeder house floor. Not even used. And that's quite a bit of money too. So yeah, uh, that's the new, the new old combine that I got. Hopefully it works and we can get all that stuff done and to be done. I'm ready for winter. <laughs> all right. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, yeah, leave some comments or any questions you have. I'll, I'll try to answer them all. Thanks.